Hi everyone! Today I would like to show you how we can prepare uh, an easy soup which is made out of potatoes and carrot soup with red lentils. So let's get started with the ingredients first. Um, I turn on the cooker and all what we need is two chopped onions and we need two chopped potato and also we need three chopped carrots and we need uh, one cup of red lentils as you can see it wash and clean and also we need two tablespoons of vermicelli needles and we need one liter of water one tablespoon of ghee also if you don't have ghee you can use butter doesn't matter and for the spices we need uh, one teaspoon of salt or salt to taste half teaspoon of black pepper and one teaspoon of cumin powder you can add less but i love the taste of the cumin i love to add cumin powder in my soup always first i'm going to take the one teaspoon of one tablespoon sorry of the ghee okay so here we go we heat the ghee now what i'm going to do i'm going to fry the onion fry the onions a little bit, not too much. Okay, so after we fry, fry the onion for about one minute, now what I'm going to do, I'm going to add the chicken stock, only one. I'm going to fry it until it dissolves. Just add little bit of water and that will help and that will help the chicken stock to be melt okay now I'm going to add all the spices with the salt you can add less salt if you like add a little bit of water don't want the onions to be stick and burn okay and now I'm going to add the red lentils okay I'm going to add here a little bit of water I wash them, they get hard. Okay, perfect. They smell so yummy. Now I'm going to add one liter of water. Hot water. It's better if you use hot water and that will help the soup to be cooked quickly. You can add cold water if you like. It's okay. Okay, so as you can see we add one liter of hot water. Now what I'm going to do leave the soup on high heat and I'm going to cook it until the uh, and I'm going to cook it for about 15 minutes exactly and after that we can add the vegetables I'm going to leave the vermicelli noodles until the end I'm going to add later carrots and the potatoes and then uh, boil it for another 10 more minutes and then I'm going to blend it in the blender and then uh, at the end I'm going to add the vermicelli noodles and that will be so delicious and after that I can serve it so I'll see you after that okay so as you can see after we uh, cook the lentils for about 15 minutes now I'm going to add the potatoes Oops. I'm going to add also the carrots okay so mix them and then now I'm going to cook them for about 10 minutes exactly and in medium heat and you can cover them and then after that I'm going to blend them off camera so cook them for about 10 minutes exactly and then after that blend them in the blender and then uh, I'll see you after that okay so as you can see this is after we blend the soup now what I'm going to do the final step I'm going to add the vermicelli needles after we blend the soup and then I'm going to leave it to boil just for two minutes exactly and the soup will be ready as you can see 
you have to have this consistency this looks amazing you can taste it and check it if you need more salt or pepper or cumin powder cumin powder is so delicious with the soup especially when you make the red lentil okay so i'm going to make i'm going to wait two minutes and after that we can serve it and it's really good in ramadan i love it in ramadan it's so healthy and as i said you can and also you can add chicken stock or beef stock if you don't want you can boil chicken and then put them with it and then blend them and that will be so delicious so when you serve it myself i love to to add on the top of the soup a uh, crunchy bread so if you like and then you can put it on top of the soup and that will be so delicious soup with crunchy bread okay that's amazing so as you can see this soup should be like this now what i'm going to do i'm going to turn off the cooker and i'm not going to serve it now i'm going to leave it because now it's ramadan and um and i'm going to cover it now as you can see we turned off we turned off the cooker i'm going to cover it and leave it um so after that i can serve it in a bowl so guys i hope you enjoy watching this video and i hope you like this recipe please thumbs up if you enjoy and ramadan kareem and subscribe for more videos please and stay tuned and i will see you soon in another video or another recipe of food enjoy and thanks for watching bye